Welcome to this historian video, Import and Sort, brought to you by Pixels to Pages. This video will go over the basic import, categorizing and tagging, and item properties features. This is Tamika and I will be your instructor for this video. You have several options to bring media such as photos, audio files, and PDFs into your historian media vault. In the Get Media section of the Home ribbon, you can get images off of a connected camera, scan images from a scanner, get images from a specified folder on your computer, have historians search your entire computer for media, or pull images from social media. For the purpose of this video, I will select the Files folder to pull images from the Pictures folder on my computer. This is also the option you will choose when trying to pull images from an external hard drive. I will select all of the images in this folder and select Open to begin loading the items into my Media Vault. Note that these images are being copied into your vault, so the original images will remain in the My Pictures section of my computer. I noticed that the images my photographer gave me for my daughter's birthday party had tags already embedded into the metadata. Historian wants to know if I want these tags added to my vault. I will change the tag from Tiara's birthday party slightly. And since I'm sure I'm not in all of these pictures, I will uncheck the Tamika tag so that the images are imported, but the Tamika tag is not. Now all of the media is imported. Historian changes the view so that you're only viewing images that were imported on that day. It's as easy as that. Now if you'd like, you can sort your images by categorizing, tagging, and updating the item properties. Doing so will make your media easy to search. Let's start with item properties. While having an image selected, you can give it a star rating. You can tell a little bit about the item in the Tell Your Story section. And you can rename the image to something more meaningful. Hit Save. You can rename several images at a time by selecting those images and typing the new name. Now let's look at categories and tags. These are the images that I imported that had tags already in the metadata. Here you can see my edited tag. The images that are just imported belong in several different categories. So I can go and select a group of images that belong in a particular category. Go to the Tags panel, right click an existing category, a menu will appear, and you should select Create Category. Give the category a name and select OK. You cannot add media to a category without adding them to a tag within that category. So while still having those items selected, right click the category you just created, select Create a Tag, type the tag name, and click OK. Drag and drop the selected images on the tag to add them to that tag. To view the images in a particular category or tag, simply select the desired category or tag. For more information on importing and sorting media, please check out the many offerings available on this website. Thanks for watching.